My name is Deborah Bowens. My husband, Luther Bowens, and I are embarking upon a new endeavor called Barbie Queen Parties. And basically, Barbie Queen Parties are parties for little girls, kind of bringing them back charm and etiquette and grace. For little girls, we kind of got away from that as a society and kind of transformed into bad girls clubs or head being charged. But what we'd like to do is bring that back or introduce that back into society again of what it's like to be a little girl, to be a little princess, a little queen. So we did a little test run here in our garage. We transformed it into a little studio, invited my granddaughter and 15 of her little friends. And as you can see in the clip coming up, that it was very successful. And what we would like to do is introduce that or give many more little girls that experience of what it's like to be charming and, and full of grace. So we'd like to thank you for your support, and I hope to see you and your daughters at one of our events. And thank you so much, and have a wonderful day. God bless you. Bye-bye. Why do you think this concept would work? Well, I have an eight-year-old and she's over there enjoying herself and it's actually good. It's actually, um, the way that um, uh, the instructor started with uh, uh, sitting down and placing their hands, you mm -hmm. know, and sitting correctly as women, it's really, I, mean, it's, I tell my daughter that all the time, but somebody else telling her that makes me, and it just encourages me, encourages me to keep on doing that and then she's doing that. I think it's wonderful. Do you think there's a need for it? Yes, definitely a need. There's a lot of girls and there's a lot of moms that are looking for things for um, their play dates. I do play dates like at least every weekend or every other weekend. And um, I would definitely, if it was affordable, it would definitely be my daughter and her friends here. Please. girls would gravitate to a business like this? What, what do you think they would gravitate? Um, I would say first because they, girls are, you know, we're just girly by nature and we love, like my girls, for example, always love um, playing dress up. They, even still, they still like to dress up. How, how old are your daughters, if you can ask? Uh, 14, 16, 18, and 20. Okay. And then Your daughter, she was at our first tea party. Could you uh, uh, could you share with us what she said about it and why she felt that, that she wanted to have a birthday party here? Well, we're here. She wanted that. That's all she talked about. 
you know, Kamaya was really shy before. Mm -hmm. um, you know, when other girls did like different things, she was really shy, stayed to herself. Mm -hmm. But that first event that she went to, she came home, she blossomed. Yes, you know, she was no longer shy, mm -hmm. she participated. You know, it was just, I just saw a transition. I just saw a little flower that just blossomed mm -hmm. after that first event. And she just loved it. And so this is what brought us here for her birthday. She wanted to have a tea party slash princess diva <laughs> birthday event. So, you know, it really meant a lot to her. She wouldn't stop talking about that day. You know, the fashion show down to the T. But I think she really enjoyed the fashion show, walking that catwalk. Mm -hmm. The music and everything, yes. that I see that Deborah has and Luther has is a great concept to train our kids in the way that they should be trained. Yeah. Going back to uh, basic fundamentals of raising a child back when we were